This video is about the importance of shaking golden archival varnish prior to spraying it on your artwork. It is important to shake the spray varnish can for at least two minutes. Improper shaking may result in an uneven sheen and spattery texture. Two minutes may seem like a long time, but tests show this is the minimum amount of time to properly mix the varnish for uniform spraying patterns. One of the main causes of a poor spray pattern is improper shaking. Aerosol varnish is very thin, and therefore a considerable amount of settling occurs inside the can while it sits on a shelf. Inside the aerosol can is a long plastic stem extending to the bottom of the can. If the product is improperly mixed, thicker globs of varnish can partially clog the stem and spattering is likely. In the satin and matte varnishes, there will be a layer of matted solids at the bottom of the can. The stem will pull the bottom layer of settled solids up first, creating excessive matting. But then the remainder of the can will be increasingly glossy. So not only does this result in a glossier than desired sheen, the initial product may cloud the painting surface because of the heavy buildup of matting solids. Therefore, increase your chances for success by taking the proper amount of time to fully shake your can of golden archival varnish. We also suggest shaking the can for 15 seconds for each minute of spray time. If you have previously used a spray can, be sure to spray off the side of the artwork for a few seconds before actual use. This clears the valve stem of unmixed product. You're almost there, just a few seconds more. Well done, your archival varnish is now ready to use.